you got questions, we've got answers. We have the man to answer them. Jeffrey Levine from Buckingham Wealth Partners. Jeffrey, welcome back to another episode of Ask the Hammer. It is great to be with you as always, Bob. It's great to have you here. I understand you have a question or two in your inbox. Indeed, the inbox is full today. And uh, this question comes from us from Walter. Walter asks uh, several questions. He says, I just turned 72 this year. It's my first year of taking RMDs. Um, and as a side note, naturally, you know, Bob, there are a lot of questions when people first have to start taking RMDs. And Walter has a few in specific. He asks, can I transfer the stock I have in my traditional IRA uh, into a, a cash account? And I think the cash account here, by, by my understanding, is his taxable account, his non-IRA. Or do, does he need to sell them at the current value and then put the cash in? So can I do this transfer of RMDs in kind? Uh, second question is, let's say that the transfer is for $10,000. So the RMD is for $10,000. How much of that can be turned into the Roth? Is it limited to $7,000 per year? Um, and then can the $10,000 RMD be transferred directly to Roth? So let's address each one of those individually. The first part or the answer to the first question is absolutely. You certainly can take your RMD in kind. There's no rule that you have to take an RMD in cash. So whether you want to take it in stock or distribute bonds or whatever it may be, or cash, that's fine. It's up to you. When you distribute an asset from an IRA, any asset, it must be valued at its fair market value. So some people, they might own actually the building next door in their IRA, right? It's a uh, in like a self-directed IRA account. They might actually own a actual piece of real estate as opposed to like a real estate investment trust. Well, if you've got to distribute it, it's distributed at the fair market value of the property. Same thing goes for stocks or bonds or mutual funds, ETFs. What is the fair market value? And the custodian will, will do that reporting for you because they're going to have to issue the 1099. But that is how we satisfy an RMD in kind. The other questions were, uh, essentially, can I move it directly to a Roth? And if not, how much of it can I put back into a Roth if it goes to the, the taxable or cash account first? First part of that, no, you cannot go directly to a Roth because your RMD cannot be rolled over. And in a Roth conversion is just a fancy type of rollover. It's one flavor of rollover, if you will. It's just a rollover from a traditional style account to a Roth account, but it's still a rollover under the rules. And so you cannot do that. You could convert anything in excess of that amount. So if the RMD was 10,000 and you took that, you can convert anything in your traditional IRA above and beyond the 10,000 you took to satisfy the RMD. And the $10,000 that you took out as an RMD can be used to help pay the tax bill on the other money, but you can't convert that 10,000 itself. Now, as far as the $7,000 cash going back into a Roth, that is going to be uh, wholly dependent upon whether the individual is still working and whether their income levels are uh, below the Roth IRA contribution limits. There is no age limit for contributing to a Roth, so that's not a factor. But does the person have the right type of income? Does Walter have the right type of income? That means earnings typically. So is still W-2 income or is there self-employment income, but not interest, not dividends, not social security, none of those things count. Um, and on top of that, if Walter does have uh, the right type of income, does he have too much total income, right? Because if your income exceeds certain thresholds, then you are prohibited from making a direct contribution to a Roth IRA. Hmm. So uh, assuming that he can make the Roth contribution, there's no reason why he can't take the amount from his RMD and use that to contribute to the Roth. Yeah, effectively, once you take your RMD, it's yours. It's like it's free money. The fact that it happened to be in a IRA or a four really is meaningless. You took it out, you did your thing. Now, if you want, you can put it back in. In fact, there are some people today. You know, if if you have a traditional IRA and you're still working, you can make your traditional IRA contribution, but you also uh, have to take your RMD. So it's kind of like a revolving door of, of IRA money for some folks once they get to that age. They're like, all right, I took out the amount I had to take out. But I really don't want to pay tax in it. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it right back in. And as long as it's you know less than your compensation for the year, so the amount of your earnings or the maximum six or seven thousand dollar IRA contribution. In that case, if you're 72 and above, it would be seven thousand. That kind of revolving door actually does work. The same thing happens a lot of the time with SEP IRA owners who are working past 72. They may have substantial RMDs, 
but they also may be able to put 60,000 plus away in retirement this year. So in some cases, maybe they're taking out 30, but they're putting it back in 60. It's a net you know, 30 benefit for them of putting dollars in, but there is no exception to the rule for taking RMDs because you're still working for IRA accounts, including SEPs and SIMPLES, uh, as well as traditional IRAs. You can't convert it. So the best you can do is use that money that you've already taken out. And if possible, again, if you're still working, contribute it back in as new money. Mm. Sounds like a great strategy. And hopefully we solved uh, answered Walt's question and, uh, and then some. Yeah, we certainly hope so. And uh, we'd love it if you would contribute to our pool of questions. So if you've got a question for us, hit us up, email us at askthehammer at buckinghamgroup.com. Again, that's askthehammer right here, ask the hammer at buckinghamgroup.com. And we will look forward to seeing your questions in our inbox real soon.